Hey, Brian, tell us where you work and tell us a little bit about the Pink Pro. Uh, Stymist RV and Boat in Placerville, California. Okay. What, uh, what uh, benefits are you getting with the Pink Pro here? Uh, faster dry times, uh, clears flowing better and actually drying between coats better. Yeah. Uh, allowing me to put it on faster. Okay. Okay. So uh, tell us a little bit about this job you're working on right here. Uh, four different colors. I've got a dark gray, a black, a white, and a light gray. Um, I've got two colors on here already today. Um, a lot of masking, as you can tell with the graphics. Uh, I probably won't be able to get all four colors on today. But if I had a simple four color job without all the graphics, I would absolutely be able to do all four colors and clear today. Wow. In one eight hour day. Okay. Um, so tell me about your usage of your clear. Um, um, are you seeing a reduction in the amount of clear that you're using? Or are you seeing any benefits absolutely. when you're clearing? Um, most of the time I'll put a third coat on a clear just to give me a little bit extra and to make it flow a little better, make it a little bit heavier bodied, not so dry. Mm -hmm. uh, with a paint bro, it's flowing better. Uh, mm -hmm. Doesn't matter what clear I'm using. Um, so I'm literally just down to two coats of clear now. Wow, that's awesome. So um, when you got this paint pro, it was a little cooler out, especially in the mornings. Absolutely. You were liking it in the mornings because it was cool and yep. it was actually warming up and allowing you to do more. Yeah. Now today, it's nearly 100 degrees. In the booth. In the booth. Are you still using the paint pro when it's 100 degrees? Yep, just used it 30 minutes to go on the white. And yeah. Dry the touch. And you're using it on the 105 setting. Today I did, yeah. Today. Yeah. When you get into the cooler months, you'd be using it on the warm-up setting? Uh, warm-up and sometimes 105. Depends on if it's a metallic or not. So you did automotive uh, painting before. Would you uh, use this in an automotive setting as well as the RV? Absolutely. Yeah? yeah. What, what benefits would you see when, you know, back when you were doing the automotive painting? What, how, how would it have uh, benefited you there? I would have got cars in and out faster. I yeah. probably would have had at least one more car a day. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, one more car a day, that's pretty good. Yeah. All right, cool. Thank you, Brian. Appreciate it. You're very welcome.